Well, hello folks. This is Pete Neighbour. And uh, like everyone else, I'm in lockdown, quarantine, self-isolation, whatever you want to call it. Mark asked many of us to uh, say a few words and uh, about how we're coping with it all. And I was actually very reluctant to do this because I, the idea of Mark's uh, uh, suggestion is obviously to inspire people. And uh, I'm actually finding it very tough at the moment. <laughs> I don't feel very inspiring. I'm finding uh, I travel a lot, as many of you know, and um, uh, for the last uh, for the last four weeks I've been home. I've had first, the first two weeks I was uh, self quarantined because uh, I'd come back from London. Immediately prior to that, I'd been to uh, Asia. I'd been to Singapore, to uh, Thailand, to Vietnam. Uh, so uh, I've also felt a little bit uh, worried about um, how I might be. <laughs> but touch wood, everything has been fine. Fingers crossed. And uh, now I'm uh, well. I'm I'm out and about as much as I can be, which basically means the grocery store every couple of days or every few days. And otherwise, it's um, trying to have the inspiration to play. And it is very hard. It's difficult. Um, I find it best for me, and we're all we're all individuals. We all have our own routines and what works for us. But I find that. It's best for me if I get up in the morning and go ahead and do it. Uh, I get it, get it out of the way. I, my days of practicing six and seven hours a day are long gone, I have to say. But I do like to practice every day. I'm probably practicing about five days out of seven now. I just, some days I just cannot face it. So I'll do a couple of hours. And also, as I know many of you will know, and I constantly tell people that ask me about practice regimes in uh, in more ordinary times, uh, little and often. If it's not working, I just give up. I, 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 I stop, I go and have a cup of coffee, I just you know, watch the news, I just, I just scroll FaceTime, <laughs> I do whatever. But uh, if I can do just 30 minutes of good, solid practice, the boring stuff, I do a lot of the boring stuff, a lot of scows, a lot of arpeggios, a lot of long notes, a lot of uh, exercises, some of which I've done for years. So it's not necessarily learning new stuff, but it's keeping the chops in shape. And that's the biggest worry for me is keeping the chops in shape because like all of us, I have what we call snow blindness in the diary. I open my diary and it's like this sea of white. Um, and, uh, but the time will come where the phone will ring or the email will ping and uh, we're going to have to have our chops in shape. So um, uh, I'm trying to do it, but uh, I'm not going to pretend it's easy. So if you are finding it tough, there's a lot of us finding it tough. Believe you me. <laughs> Believe you me. See you later.